Hi everyone, my, my name is Daniela. I'm from Costa Rica and I am a human rights defender. I'm compromised with LGBTI human rights and HIV youth human rights. Being visible as a bisexual woman. And for me, this, this was like a, a big important moment in my life. I was very afraid of my family support and also um, my environmental work. And I was wondering if anyone has come through this. So I started to uh, attending some meetings about human rights, some of the LGBTI people in Costa Rica. Human rights defenders can't stop in this moment and has been demonstrated that their rule of law is it's, um, in serious risk. People are losing their freedom, the freedom of speech in some of the countries. Uh, mostly LGBTI people is facing a lot of discrimination. Uh, trans workers and sexual commerce are in serious risk because of the pandemic 19. So this is the moment that we must work. Because this could make the process of the UPR more orderly and also the people is going to have the opportunity to engage with uh, different diplomats and these political spaces. The financial support is very important. Attending to Geneva, um, it's great because you have the opportunity to talk with others attending to the different um, meetings um, that, that is being able in Geneva in that moment and mostly talk with your government. So I think that um, if you don't have the financial support, you can ask for support uh, like I did uh, from the office of the United Nations here in Costa Rica and they support me to travel to Geneva and all their international organiz organizations help me. Promote respect for sexual diversity is important, it's important. And I think that, um, I really hope to promote social projects based on and the respect of, you know, of LGBT people and also promote educational trainings. And I want to say thank you very much for this great opportunity. And I want to say to everyone who is watching this, to don't be afraid to participate or engage with these mechanisms. It's important as a civil society uh, to participate, engage with these political spaces to make changes to our governments and our public policies.